name is Jenny and I'm with Got Beauty and today I am here with Alicia. She is our Dermalogica Skin Care Specialist and she's going to give us a little preview of what it means to have your skin looked at in the skin scanner. So Alicia, can you tell me, when you look at my skin in here, what are you going to see underneath the surface? So that's exactly what we're looking for. We're going to see what sun damage is going on underneath the surface of your skin, as well as any dehydration, where your oil glands are producing oil, and anything going on that you can't see to the naked eye. So to be honest, I was a lifeguard for years. I probably was in the sun way too much without SPF. I'm a little scared to get in the skin scanner. Uh, if you see stuff in there, the sun damage under the surface, are there things you can tell me to do to really help prevent me from seeing that uh, come to the surface as I age? Absolutely. We're well, using great skincare. You know, it's going to help your skin now and in the future. And of course, the number one thing you can do for your skin is wear sunscreen every day. It's the number one anti-ager for the skin, and that's where you see the most benefit and prevent that pigmentation. So even during the winter, even when it's not sunny <laughs> and I'm really not outside, I still need to use an SPF every day. Absolutely. So, you know, we don't get that sun damage through that one week when we're on vacation. We're getting the majority of our sun damage just through incidental sun. In fact, 80% of our sun damage just comes from that incidental sun exposure. Walking to and from your car, getting the mail, walking your dog. That's where we're actually getting the majority of your sun damage. Okay. And actually 65% of sun, sun damage just comes through the car window. So whether it's sunny outside, snowing, raining, it's important to have your skin protected. So I know there's a lot of different SPFs out there and what, you know, if I'm outside all day, getting in the garden this time of year, everybody's outside, how often should I be reapplying? That's a great question. So if you are actually in the sun, um, like you mentioned, gardening, at the pool, out playing with your kids at the park, you do want to reapply every two hours. Every two hours. Set your timer. Set your on. timer. Absolutely. Okay. And that's where you're going to see, the, that's where you're going to get the most prevention and the most benefits for your skin with the sunscreen. Okay. So I think I'm ready. Okay. Let's look at my skin in there. <laughs> okay. All right. So you're going to get all the way in there for me. There's a mirror, so you'll be able to see your skin as well. Wow. Oh my goodness. There's so much under there. Okay, Alicia, so it looked a little scary under there. Tell me what, what's going on. Well, first of all, you have fantastic skin, so go home and kiss your mom and tell her <laughs> thank you. Um, you know, we did see some pigmentation. You know, obviously, you know, you have those concerns from being a lifeguard. So any area that we saw with any sunspot, dark spot, or freckle is that pigmentation underneath the surface of the skin. We also saw some dehydration, some purplish tones right underneath of your eye area and down the length of your nose and a little bit in your cheeks. And that dehydration is actually lacking water in the skin. Okay. So drinking more water, but also using products with ingredients like hyaluronic acid will actually help really help, will really help contain the water inside of your skin. Um, we did see some little orange dots around your nose. Those are your blackheads. Oh, <laughs> so using a really great exfoliator that's gentle to use every day, like the Dermalogica Daily Microfoliant, will really help keep your skin nice and polished and keep those pores clear. Okay, so for me, on top of what I'm doing, I already cleanse twice a day. Perfect. I need to use maybe a different moisturizer with hyaluronic acid and then I need to use an SPF, and I'm gonna be okay? You're gonna be just fine. Okay, <laughs> thank you so much. Yes, you're welcome. Okay, thanks guys.